Hey guys, in the this site from 24 by 7 everything. Hope you all are doing great. We are again back with another video and this time it's on Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1. So in this particular video we'll discuss uh, this part, uh, like issue related to update is not showing up whenever you are putting your Android 10 Beta 4 version 432's update file in internal storage and so on. So let's begin with that. So whenever you will be putting it uh, and restarting your phone, it should uh, show you like this, like system update file detected and so on. If it will be in more than two, uh, more than one place, then it will list it out there. But this video is specifically for those who are not even getting this one, like after after restarting their phone and by putting uh, the file inside uh, their internal storage. So let me confirm you that as well. So I've already put it into my internal storage and a part of this it was also on download that's why it was showing. But let's discard this that like you had already put and you, you are not getting that uh, particular update notification. One more thing before we proceed into that particular step. So I've already created a dedicated article for the same that how you can download it and what so on related to this particular update with the version 432 Android 10 Beta 4. So basically nothing major has been mentioned, few minor things like Android 10 Beta 4 file which comprises of 1.67 GB. There is an important note for Android Pi user like you should at least be on 062 update your phone. And for Android 10 Beta, whether you are on 407, 424 or 429, you will be able to do that. But there is a bummer like on 063 and 087 whether you have key, uh, have your pin pa pattern password or swipe anything whether it you have kept it or removed it you will surely be getting that particular error where you have to reset your phone and i'm using 087 and i'll confirm you that as well so we will be touching that part in this video as well and a part of this you can download the file directly from here which is again from the official asus server side otherwise you can go into the go to the asus web, official website and download it now, as I mentioned you that I'm already on a 087 version. So 087 with the security patch level 5 September 2020. So now what you have to do that if you are not getting that update notification, you have to download that file and co copy the same into your SD card. So let me show you. So I'm all, I have already copied the same file in my SD card. Now what we have to do, we have to restart our phone. And we have to boot into the stock recovery mode by tapping on or by pressing the volume down button. So keep pressing until unless you will be booted into the recovery mode or I would say stock recovery mode. So finally we have been booted to the stock recovery mode. So now what we have to do, we have to select one uh, like fourth option from the below that is update, uh, apply update for external storage. Before doing anything, uh, the best part is that you have to take backup because this will surely be resulting into the uh, I would say factory data reset for two versions one is 063 and 087 but for the others as well I will recommend to take backup because you never know these are the beta versions and they can do anything on the fly so I've just selected that apply update and afterward it will directly open my SD card and now I'll be selecting the second file from the top that is 432 version and I'm going to press okay or i would say power button now that particular update installation process has been started and it is verifying and afterward it will patch that particular system image and so on so let's wait till that time this will be going to complete again a precautionary note you have to take backup before doing this thing otherwise you will lose data and afterward even no one can help you in that so let's wait till that time this installation process completes so finally the android 10 beta 4 update has been installed now we have to reboot our system and as soon as the booting process will be completed after this Zenfone logo you will see that particular password related prompt because we are on 087 so I'll show you that how to get uh, basically we just have to reset our phone so that's why it will so this video will be a dual purpose or I would say serve as a dual purpose one would be related to that update notification which is not coming on your phone and a part of this this will also confirm you that on 087 your phone will need uh, I would say hard reset or factory reset. So this is what I was saying. If I will be entering my pin, then it will it will say wrong password and so on. So now what we have to do, we have to again restart our phone and again move to the stock recovery mode by pressing volume down button. So keep on pressing until unless you move to the stock recovery mode.
so as soon you as soon as you will be moving to the stock recovery mode now you have to press that particular fourth option from the top that is five data and factory reset just press this before doing this part you should take backup of all all of your internal storage because this will wipe everything and you will not be able to recover it so now it will hardly take 5 to 10 seconds to complete the formatting and now we are good to go with the reboot system now our phone will be encrypting the data and afterward move to the phone setup process so let's begin with that and afterward i'll complete the phone setup process as soon as possible so that i can directly boot into the android and beta 4 version so finally the phone setup process has been initiated let me try to complete this as soon as possible and i'll, I'll show you the android 10 beta version by moving into the login screen or home screen so after setting the phone setup process or completing the phone setup process we have been directly booted to the android 10 beta 4 version so let me confirm you that as well so android 10 with 432 security patch level 5 august 2020 so this was all from my side related to how uh, the problem being faced by a few users like update is not showing whenever they are trying to update and write and beta 4 version. Hope you like this video. If you really like this video, kindly share this with your friends and family. And apart from this, please subscribe to our channel because this will surely motivate us and boost us to create more videos like this in the coming future. Finally, it's the time to sign off now. Bye for now. Thanks.